Shalom, Shalom. It's the brother Yahweh Shapak coming at you with another lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Double honors to my elders and apostles of Great Millstone who teach and rule well in these scriptures. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. If brothers can see this, man, it's uh, something that Ky uh, Kyrie Irving posted. And he said, Let's see, I was not put here on earth to participate in any religious political wars or incite racial disharmony, prejudice within communities. We are all equal under the sun, and I am here to participate in the building of an equal world and follow the word from the Most High God, Yah. So, got to get a couple of scriptures to cut Kyrie. First off, you know, we're not all equal. You know what I'm saying? And if you're following the word of the Most High, then you would be separating yourself from the nations, not joining hand in hand with them. You know, not trimming. Hey, Kyrie Irving is seeking, he's trimming his way to seek love. You know, he one of them niggas who's, he, he feel like if he depart from Esau, he gonna have a great sorrow. So he want to ride the fence. Hey, how about some of y'all was shy ain't dealing with no lukewarm ass celebrity Israelite, man. So you niggas may as well pack it up. The Lord ain't dealing with you or Kanye, bro. It's nice that hey, the Lord put the spirit on y'all to put that spotlight on the truth. That's cool. But y'all uh, y'all ain't going, you know, y'all ain't going to enter into the kingdom of heaven, man. You too caught up in this world. But anyway, let me get a couple of precepts to cut what he said, because not all people on the earth are equal, you know. And uh, Yah is not the Heavenly Father's name. It's Yahweh. You see how he pushing that with Israelites. He got King David as his profile picture, but he won't push the names. If you've heard this truth, you've heard the names of Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. I remember Kanye made a tweet referring to Esau as E. So he definitely watches GMS's videos, man. But yet here it is. Kyrie Irving is still pushing that Yahweh spirit on the world. He's still pushing that Christianity spirit. Basically that IUIC spirit, you know. You know, so that, that spirit that some of the, that, that GLCC spirit, all nations can make it as long as they repent. And, you know, they can be spiritual Israel. Nah, man, you know. The spiritual Israel that the Heavenly Father is dealing with is the elect because he's not dealing with the whole nation of Israel right now, but he's dealing with a, a remnant. But this is Deuteronomy 7 and 6. For thou art in holy people unto Yahweh thy power, for Yahweh thy power have chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all the people that are upon the face of the earth. So if you follow in the Most High God's words, you know, do you not know about Deuteronomy 7 and 6? All people on the earth aren't equal. The Lord has a people that are above all people on the earth that are special unto himself, man. That are the Israelites, you know. The Lord don't know none of these other families of the earth. And he ain't dealing with Amalek who are claiming to be uh, from the tribe of Judah. You know, who are converts. They're not real Jews. They're Jewish converts. This is Amos 3 and 1. So, like, this is Amos 3 and 1. Hear this word that Yahweh have spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, You only have I known of all the families of the earth. Therefore, I will punish, punish you for, your, for all your iniquities. So do that sound like the Most High compares, I mean, looks at all people as equal? No, nah, man, he's only known the uh, the nation of Israel. You know, the Lord only gave his law, statutes, and commandments to us. So they're really, in all actuality, can't, you know, we all the other nations are going to convert in the kingdom, but we speaking in a, in a, in a, uh, a technical sense. You can't be a Jewish convert. Either you are a Jew by blood or you're not. You know? Man, hey, they can take this video down if they want to. But the truth is out there, man. You know, and, uh, 
Jake's sick and tired of the lies. Kanye, Kanye, I mean, Kyrie just got so much of them. You know, Esau got a battery in his back at the end of the day. He does believe that we as a license. and he's trying to push it out there. But at the end of the day, he's so tied in with this goddamn devil that he can't do that. His money, his way of living is so tied in with Esau. He is afraid of fully departing away from Esau. He's a, afraid of fully detaching himself spiritually from this system. You know, this is 2nd Ezra 6 and 56. As for the other people which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing but be like unto spittle. So do that sound like the Most High, Yahweh, looks at all people as equal? No, man. It said, but be like unto spittle and has likened the abundance of them unto a drop that fallen from a vessel. So the Lord ain't looking at um, all, the nation, all the nations as equal, man. The Heavenly Father is the ultimate uh, racist or separatist, if you will. You know? There are, uh, we all come from Adam, but there's a people whom the Lord has chosen that came from Adam. Second measure six and 54, which I, which I should have read from 54 on down to 56, you know, but yeah, man, you know, Kyrie Irving was off of that statement. We're not all equal. And if, hey, hey, if you really claim to be pushing truth, or if you really know these scriptures, you wouldn't even have said nothing like that. But, you know, we know Kyrie Irving got a, a battery in his back. You know, he kissing Esau's ass at the same time, but he want to uh, look like he fighting against a system. Now, did he help to further the truth by putting out what he put out? Yeah, he did. But is he going to uh, 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 be chosen ultimately? Will he be delivered? Will he be ultimately, ultimately will he be able to separate himself fully from Esau. No. He's not going to enter into the kingdom of heaven because he's, he's, he's rich. And ultimately, man, he's not willing to uh, give all that up. Kanye's not willing to give all that up. You know? I'm trying to think of what else he said. Um, he basically was saying that he's not trying to entice um any 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 tension. Well the Heavenly Father is a is a power is a God of controversy controversy. The Heavenly Father is a This is Exodus 17 and 16. For he said, because the Lord have sworn that he will have war with Amalek from generation to generation. So who are the biblical Amalekites? Those people who are calling themselves Jewish. They're the biblical Amalekites. Everybody who is in this earth today has a biblical nationality. You come from a family that can be traced back in these scriptures. So biblically, they're the Amalekites. The Lord said he was going to have war with Amalek from generation to generation. You know, so these people are hated by Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh, Shai. And if you count them as your enemies, if you really serve the Lord, you would hate them as he hates them. But see, you're not a, you, you know, they run too much of your life. You're not a, let's see, what is, what's the word I'm looking for? Kyrie ain't that, uh, he ain't that, you know, he ain't that uh, uh, aggressive towards the, towards his slave masters. You know, he'll say little shit here and there, but he won't come out and flat out go at Amalek, man. You know? Because he don't want to get completely canceled and ostracized. You know, but that's part of it, man. Well, they're the Heavenly Father's enemies. They are our enemies. You're supposed to hate them with a perfect hatred, like the scriptures say. 
But you know, he ain't in that spirit, man. But you know, that's pretty much all I had on that. I'm going to go ahead and uh, close out by giving all praises, honor, and glories due to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. Double honors again to my elders and apostles of great millstone who teach and rule well in these scriptures. And peace and blessings to the hopeful elect.